Good morning all. I just thought I'd make a quick little video, of, an experiment of sorts. Um, I really like cooking with cast iron um, and I've, I've not got a huge amount of it. I've got maybe half a dozen pans or something like that. And if you properly season cast iron, uh, then it can be basically non-stick. Maybe not as good as Teflon, uh, but uh, I thought I would uh, do an experiment. One egg done without butter on this one here. One egg done with butter, this one here. Uh, so they're in the process of cooking and making themselves happy here. And uh, we're gonna see what happens as, uh, as we go along. Strange little split happening on my screen here. I'm not sure if that's really going on or whether it's just an illusion. But uh, to season a pan, what you end up doing is you put a very thin layer of oil on it and you put it in the oven at about 450 degrees or put it on a nice hot barbecue but it's got to be as I say at least 400 450 degrees for about half an hour uh, and what that does is it converts the plastic to um, or sorry converts the oil to plastic essentially it polymerizes it which means it breaks down all the chains and then recombines them together so you get a very hard slippery plastic surface that's bonded to the pan so uh, this is what's going on here. As you can see, this egg's almost done. It's still jiggling a little bit. So I'm going to wait until it's done jiggling. You will notice that this, this pan in the back is the one with butter. Uh, you can see it kind of shiny back there. And you can see that it, it uh, tends to sizzle a little bit. The one on the front uh, sticks a tiny bit to the pan, but we're going to see how easily it comes off. I know the one on the back is going to come off very easily. It has very little butter, just a tiny little dollop, just because I like the flavor of butter on the eggs. But I think we're almost ready to go here. Darn close to it. I just like, I don't mind a little bit of a jiggle in my egg white, but, uh, but I just don't want it to be too, too underdone. And, and interestingly enough, the longer you leave it to sit, the more likely it's going to say, okay, now I'm done and I will actually lift free of the, of the pan. When you first put it on the pan, that's when it sticks to the pan the most. And that generally occurs whether it's eggs or meat or Whatever you happen to be putting on there, uh, it'll naturally lift off the pan uh, when it's ready to go here. You know what I'm going to do is, um, I don't know if I can get this little handle, but yeah, there it goes. So the handles are getting a little hot because I've had them on there for a while. So let's, uh, actually, you know, let's start with the one in the back here. Okay, so, I don't know if I can do this one handed and give it a shot. So there's the normal leg. Come here. There we go. That's a normal leg. Let's see how it works with the other one here. Right here. And voila. As you can see, right, get off the spatula. It came off the pan just fine, but now it wants to stick to the spatula. Isn't that funny? So, there you go. One egg, two eggs, both essentially non-stick. And um, that's what you wanted. Uh, now, uh, when you finish with the cast iron pan, of course, you turn off the heat. Oh, wrong way. Turn off the heat. Uh, we'll let those cool, and then when it's done, all I do is rinse them in hot water and, uh, and pop them back in the, uh, in the thing. Uh, most times, depending upon how dry they look, I might put like a drop of oil on them just to keep them from rusting because you don't want a perfectly dry um, cast iron that's, uh, that's completely uncoated. So a lot of times I will store it with a touch of oil, but I don't think I oiled this one before I put it in last time. It was pretty dry looking, as you can see. So I'll probably put a touch of oil before I put it back in this time. But anyway... There you go. Just a, a little bit of a demonstration with cast iron and whether or not it is non-stick. And I think it is, for the most part, non-stick, even without any, uh, any uh, margarine, butter, oil, whatever you put on it. Uh, and uh, I'm now going to enjoy my eggs before they get cold. Thanks very much and have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.